Anybody that tells you that I love you for nothing is a liar. There is an interest somewhere. That is why you have to be plain. So that the person can locate the interest that he can hang his love on. Not until you have been all out and been real to yourself. I tell you, you may never find who loves you. When you are all transparent, it will shock you that your transparency will attract whose love is looking for that interest that can be found in you. But we are trying to keep so many things, protect so many things. Don't apply makeup to change your color. It can be dangerous. There are certain pictures don't put on social media. You are totally different from that picture. <laughs> You are totally different from that picture. The day you are seen face to face, there will be trouble. <laughs> Apostle, we hear of this. <laughs> there are certain editing don't do it. Even if there's, especially on your birthdays, the editing they do for you. If it comes, tell the person, this is not me, change it. I know myself. If you have a tribal mark, let it show in your pictures. Let it show. It will shock you that there is a love looking for tribal mark. I'm telling you, don't try to hide anything. There is a love whose interest is in ball legs. There is a love whose interest is in K-legs. There is a love, ladies. Don't let anybody tell you if you are hairy on the legs or on the hands, you look like a man. There is a love looking for that. Feel free. Live your life. It will shock you. The reason why you are not finding love and no love is coming is because you have changed your naturality. So, we don't know where you stand. When God is calling fair people and he's calling dark people, you, we don't know. We don't know where you stand. You must allow yourself to feel free. It will shock you that you will locate real love. Rather than, listen, if you think you are crook, there is a crooker. He is not just crook, he is crook. <laughs> you will always find your kind. Feel free. Feel free. Don't try to be too spiritual because you are looking for love. There is a love that is looking for people who pray. Car, car, car. There is a love looking for that. There is a love looking for people. Rosha, Tefra, Higa, Sotal. There is a love. <laughs> looking for that don't try <laughs> to change because if somebody comes to propose to you because of car 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 when you go home you must car car if you don't car car there will be car car <laughs> there will be trouble at home you should be able to find somebody you can feel free a man that you don't have to rush to do makeup to meet. Today I'm coming to visit you. Hey, wait, give me. <laughs> if the one you have to marry, you, you always have to do makeup to meet him. Sir, ah, that will not be love. Good days, beloved. <laughs> Very soon you start acting a nice movie. Good days, beloved. Praise the living God. But let's try to help ourselves. Don't deceive anyone. And the first step to not deceiving anyone is to be real to yourself. This is me. I didn't go to school. I didn't fail. I'm fine. I don't have the money that that guys have. I'm okay. Only that, I also have something they don't have. I am truthful. I'm faithful. I am caring. You always have something others don't have.
you don't feel bad about your life. It's not always money you should have to marry. Man, see people who have money too don't have patience. So if you have patience, you are fine. It is not every woman is looking for money. Some are very rich. They are looking for a faithful man. They are looking for a faithful man. They are looking for a passionate man. They are looking for a caring man. They are looking for somebody they can communicate with. They are looking for somebody who will be there to talk to them. So if, if you have these things and you don't have money, that doesn't mean that you should change your whole life and try to impress everybody. What you have, be it. It will attract the true love. 